Hello everyone, my name is Winters and welcome back to this Let's Play series of Care Mechanics Simulator 2018. We are not continuing on exactly from where we left off. Uh, I found, uh, I want to say this order and definitely this order, uh, or job, uh, off camera and I picked them up before uh, we lost them. Uh, I moved this car from lifter A to lifter B and I moved this one in here uh, because um, if we have any more experience orders, I want to be able to take them and uh, we have um, uh, a story order which we're actually going to pick up now. But before we do that, we're going to quickly look here and see if there are any more experience orders, which there doesn't appear to be. So we just have this story order and it is as follows. Hi, my new purchase has paid off. This caster is much better for off-roading than my SUV. Unfortunately, my bad luck is still with me, and I've had a little mishap in the forest. It's a long story. You know me, and you know of my great ideas that I sometimes get. I hope you won't give up on me when you see the car. Do whatever you can to fix it up, please. Uh, okay, so we're going to pick that one up, and we'll get a gander at it. Looks like it's in good condition, apart from missing some lights. That rim down there needs work anyway. That one down there too. Uh, let's get a gander and see. Ooh, this is a substantial list. Right, my guess is the majority of this work is going to be suspension based. And brakes and stuff. Mind you, wow, this is a, this is a big list. Um, repair, replace body parts, change and drain oil, repaint and stock color. Right, I think we should try and put this on the test path. Engine cannot start. Right, that means we're moving it to lifter A. We'll get her up on the first stage of the lift. We're going to take a quick gander at the phone here. Just in case there was any more story or uh, experience orders. And we're going to take a look in here. Oh, look at the cross member and the axle. And oh my god, yeah, it is all suspension based. Uh, right. Uh, up she goes. And we'll start off by taking off the wheels. And because uh, it looks like we're going to have to go down as far as the axles and the cross member. Um, hmm, that doesn't look too bad there. That drive shaft, though. Uh, doesn't look great. I'm gonna take out that drive shaft and That shock doesn't look too good either uh, Right, let's go on to the other side Lost my mouse there for a second uh, Drive shaft or drive axle again uh, Let's get this front drive shaft and the axle uh, we're gonna have to take out that shock. This end link is gonna have to come out so that we can get at the bottom suspension arm, which is attached to the cross member. So let's pull out these rubber bushings. And we'll do the same over the other side. Alright, let's get the end link off. And now we get the bottom suspension arm. And now the cross member. Right. Repair bench. What can we repair? Not a lot. Wow. Okay. Um, do we ha I doubt we have a drive axle. We do have drive axle. Do I want to use it? Yes, yeah, screw it. Let's use it. Uh, cross member, I doubt we have. We don't. Cross member C. Uh, drive axle. Drive axle A. Alright, I need to pick up one of those. Let's go into the store. We're going to the parts section. Uh, cross member C. Front suspension cross member C. Yep, that's the one. Um, what else did I say? Drive axle, isn't it? Drive axle A. 
We'll pick up like three of them, we'll have two spare. Uh, middle mufflers, I know we need some of those. We'll pick up like four of them. Um, drive, shaft. I think it's drive, shaft, D, but I can't be sure about that. So we'll leave that up there for now. And we'll come back to it in a minute or two. Whoops. <clears throat> Excuse me. There's a new cross member. And we'll get rubber bushings put in place. Uh, actually, bottom suspension arm, you can go in next. Along with all new rubber bushings. And the end link. Second and ones can go in. Get this rubber bushing in. Looks like we're going to have to buy more rubber bushings. Let's go over this side. Suspension arm. And the end link. And we need rubber bushings. Rubber. And we'll pick up like a baker's dozen. Alright, so we'll get these in. I'll get this one in. Now we can put in that drive axle. And we need to take off this transfer case. So drive shaft is coming out. All right, now the transfer case. And let's put in the exhaust stuff. So the are there catalytic converters? I don't have any of those, but I do have middle mufflers, so they can go in. Uh, looks like we need exhaust pipe. Holy Hannah! Look at the back axle on it. Jesus Christ! The whole thing needs to be done. She needs to be stripped down to the maker's name. Christ almighty. What was this guy doing? Um, double wishbone shock absorber. Right, let's let's start. The, we'll finish off the front stuff first. Oh, the shock is alright there. Is the shock alright in this one? It is. Okay, and I think I have... Replacement parts. Actually, do you know what? Just in case, uh, let's go for spring. And we'll see. Shock absorber, spring. We need a cap. Okay. We need caps. So I need to go for shock. Shock absorber caps. We'll buy like four of them. I have a couple spare. Now we'll put the new stuff together. Alright, that's that one done. Now we'll get the next one done. So we'll finish off with the front first, at least as far as the gearbox. And then we'll start working down the back, because the back is in tatters now. Alright, that's that one in. The tire can go back on, or the wheel can go back on, I should say. And same with this shock. And the wheel. Alright, now we move down the back. Should have got an exhaust pipe, so shouldn't I? Alright. 
wheel you're coming off and the rim has to be taken care of because it's in bits. Uh, let's take this one off as well. And now we're going to strip her down the whole lot. The whole back end of this thing is coming off. Alright, knuckle. Off you come. Rubber bushing. Out you come. Same with this one. Then we'll work on the U-bolts. place, followed by the spring, followed by the shock, and now we start working on the other side. So calipers, you're coming off, brake pads, disc, drive axle, hub, knuckle, and let's get these rubber bushings out. Same with this one. bolt and the second one followed by the plate followed by the spring followed by the shock followed by the axle itself and look at the fuel tank and the fuel pump right now we're going to see what we can recondition if anything not a lot <laughs> Okay, um, I need an axle. Uh, I think they're knuckle housing bees, aren't they? I'll buy two. It could be C's actually. Shit. Ah, screw it, we'll buy two of those as well. Um, coil spring rear drive. No, it's not a coil spring, it's a leaf spring, isn't it? That's a front drive axle, that's not what I'm looking for. Leaf spring rear drive axle, that's what I'm looking for, there we go. Alright, let's see if we did indeed buy the right ones. We did. Now, knuckle C, alright, I'm glad I picked those up. Wheel hub 3, we have some. Followed by solid drive axles, we have them. Followed by brake disc, we have them. Brake pads, we don't have them. Right, springs, do we have springs? We do indeed. Uh, plate, we have those. I know we have small rubber bushings. U-bolts, we have loads of them. And shock absorber B, isn't it? I doubt we, oh we do. Okay, we're looking good there. Let's move over the other side. Get this side put together. Now the brake disc. We're using up a lot of our parts here actually. I just noticed that. Uh, right, leaf spring, you're next. Uh, may as well do the rear shock absorber. Now the place, followed by the U-bolts. And now the rubber bushings. Okay, so I need to get brake pads. Rear muffler V8. An exhaust pipe and two catalytic converters. Rear muffler V8. Let's see how much of this I can remember. Right, brake. So brake pads, and we'll buy like a dozen. Um, brake disc, we'll buy four. Brake dispenser, we'll buy four. 
This is all about getting parts. Um, now, that rear muffler. I think that's what it was called, wasn't it? Rear muffler. Rear muffler V8. We'll buy two. Um, catalytic converter. We'll buy two. Exhaust pipe. We'll buy three. Because we'll have some spare. Um, <coughs> excuse me. What else is there? Solid rear drive axle. I'm going to buy four of those. Even though we don't need them now, I think we're going to need them in the future. Um, Alright, and I think that's it. Uh, I'm actually quite pleased with myself there. That's a lot of stuff that I remembered. Just hope I haven't forgotten anything. Uh, or picked up the wrong items. <laughs> Which is probably the case. Right. Uh, there's no point in doing the wheels. Oh, the fuel tank. I forgot the fuel tank. It's always something. Alright. Rear muffler. Exhaust pipe. Alright, catalytic converter. And the other one. Now, let's get that fuel tank. Fuel. And we'll get uh, three fuel pumps, because I think I'm out of them. Uh, we'll pick up four fuel filters. And we want a fuel tank. Uh, do you know what? I'm going to pick up three of those as well. So, fuel tank. Followed by a fuel pump. And... The wheels I still have to sort out. Uh, how's that transfer case? There we go, reconditioned. Uh, now this front drive shaft B, I need one of those. And that drive shaft is fine. It's a long sound bitch, isn't it? Uh, so what is it? A front drive shaft B. Uh, I think shaft should return that one for us, shouldn't it? Shaft. There we go. Down to the F's. Front dry shaft B. Okay. So now it's just the wheels. So, I am going to break down the two that we have and they are wrong color they are rim classic classic uh, zero nine zero nine C C and they are two seventy five slash 55 are 20s in the 20s huh? and the tires are fine the tires themselves are fine it's just the rims that I need now I might be able to recondition maybe one of the rims I'm going to quickly go into the rim section. Rim Classic. Rim Classic 09C. There it is there. Alright. We'll take this apart. Let's see if we can recondition these. Just the one. That's fine. Because we can start putting this one together. Now we'll buy the... Placement. 
size 20, ET0. Take that one apart, put it in here, get it balanced. Now we'll put this one together. And we are really coming close to the end of this uh, job. Of course, we do have to still paint it, if I remember correctly. Uh, let's put on this wheel. Alright, we'll go back and pick up the last one. As soon as it finishes, that is. Now, let's take a gander at what is done and what is not done. So, we'll mark all this stuff off that we've completed. We are looking really good here now, so far. Aha! Apparent not discovered. Son of a bitch. Four items still not discovered. Body parts. Change oil. Repaint and stock color. Damn it! What have I not identified? Um, well, there's nothing down the back here because the back has been completely rebuilt. So it must be something up front. Could it be... Barons? Nope. Do some inspections on some of this stuff. See if we can find whatever it is that needs to be replaced. Alright, nothing there. Uh, sway bar's fine, I think, if memory serves. Alright, let's check over this side. Baron is fine. Knuckle is fine. Hub is fine. Outer tie rod's fine. Inner tie rod's fine. Brake pads are fine. Brake disc is fine. Now, upper suspension arm. I'm thinking... I'm thinking... Rubber bushings in the suspension arm. It's the only thing it could be. It's the only thing I can think of off the top of my head. Uh, let's take off the, the wheels. And we'll go for that upper suspension arm. Ah, there we go, yeah. Aha! Sneaky little bastard. Actually, you know what? We'll take off the other one and we'll recondition those suspension arms and then come back and uh, push the reconditioned ones in. Right, so I want to repair these two, like so. And now we put them back with new rubber bushings. Put the wheels back on. Now we move over the other side, and we do the same thing here. Alright. Now I think we can drop her down. Oh, did I change the oil? I can't remember if I changed the oil. Just quickly. Aha, we didn't. Do I have to do the filter? Repair body parts, change oil, and refill new. Right, so there is no filter that we have to replace. So now she can come down. 
all the way. And we need to put in fresh oil. And then once this is done, which it should be any second now, we'll move on to the body work that needs to be done. So all done here, not done there, done there, and not done there. Right. We, whoops, sorry about that. That was probably rather loud for you guys. Uh, we need to make a list, so it's a uh, rear bumper, uh, rear left fender, rear left fender, rear right fender, rear right fender, uh, left headlight, left headlight, uh, left side mirror, left side mirror, uh, left tail lice, left tail lice, uh, right tail lice, right tail lice, uh, we need a trunk, trunk, we need a rear window, rear window, and we need a rear left door window, rear left door window. Okay, and it's a caster, caster. Earthquake. <coughs> Excuse me. Right. Rear bumper. We'll start off by taking... There is no rear... Alright, oh, so we're just going to have to buy these parts. Right, so we're going into the body shop section. And we are looking for a... Castor... Earthquake. <coughs> Excuse me. So we are looking for a rear, oh hello, damn it, there's the rear bumper, rear left fender, rear left fender, rear right fender. Left headlights, left headlights, left side mirror, left side mirror, uh, left tail lights, left tail lights, right tail lights, uh, we need a trunk, where is the trunk? I'm not seeing the trunk. Ah, oh, here it is. We need a rear window. Nope, that's not it. Here we go, rear window. And um, we need a rear left door window. Rear left door window. All right, it must be up here somewhere. Front right door window. Caster earthquake. Rear right door window. Is that right? No, left window. There we go. Right. Now, let's start putting these bits on. All of this will be done very, very quickly. Because all the parts are highlighted that are missing. Uh, now, there's bound to be 
a license plate, which we don't have, so I better buy one. Um, plates, and we're going to go down to Ireland. There we go, and we'll buy one. 85, are you kidding me? Okay, I think that is the bodywork done. So now it's just repaint it. So we're going to move it to the paint shop. And hopefully we're going to paint it in a much nicer color. Nope. It's going to be the same crappy green. <laughs> a blue. A nice metallic blue would have been nice there, I think. Uh, so now we'll move it back to lifter A. And we'll do one last check. So, we are all done there, all done there, all done there, and all done there. Sweet. So, we spent 13500 on parts and we're getting 43000 back in payouts. Holy Hannah. Cha-ching. Thank you very much. How are we doing on time? 31 minutes. Right. Quickly, let's check the phone. See if there are any experience orders for us to pick up. Yay, there is. All right, keep on checking. Right, so we are gonna work on this one in our next episode. So we'll move it to lifter A. And this one then after it, so we'll move that one to lifter B. And this one then after that, so we'll move you to lifter C. And yep. That's it. Perfect order. Right. We are going to leave it there for now. Thanks so many for watching, folks. I hope you all enjoyed this episode. If you did, please like, comment, and subscribe. Uh, it means an awful lot to me, and I really appreciate your support so much because it means so much. And uh, it makes such a huge difference. Anyway, my name is Winters, and I'll catch you next time. So until then, adios.